welcome back to the Freak Show, ladies and gentlemen. It is me, Jax and Falk. I'm oh, sorry. It's me, Jax and Falk. It's joining me when we do stuff. Right? Super deep voice. Uh oh. Hey guys, how's it going? Just a cleric over here chilling. You're a traveling merchant, huh? I like to talk to you. Hello, stranger. Hi. If you want to buy or sell something before you continue on, then I am your man. You're creepy. But that's okay. You're allowed to be creepy. What do you have to trade? What do everything you have to trade? Everything your heart could desire. Everything. Literally everything, huh? A serrated axe. Uh, some hand grenades. Those are not expensive. And pretty effective. I think we're going to buy a couple of hand grenades. I'm so sorry. I'm going to be a little bit expensive, but I think it's okay. And I'm pretty sure we can actually sell a, a fairly uh, sizable chunk of junk to you, friend. You really do have a lot of stuff. Natural elix, mana claws, teeth, tape, all sorts of instructions on how to make, make an amulet of camouflage. What? I don't even know what that does. It sounds cool, though. Enemies delay their attacks. Interesting. Yeah, I suppose I'll take pretty much all your uh, your pew pew shooty stuff. You don't have a lot of weaponry though. Not that you necessarily need to, but that is one of your more weak points, we'll say. A scrap shield, well, that's fine. Okay, and we would like to sell you some stuff. I think. Helmet, yeah, yeah, I think so. We'll keep that one if we're gonna do something. Don't really need any of these things anymore. Acolyte armor is pretty significantly better than everybody else's, so let's get rid of these. I'm not gonna be a berserker, so I don't need that amulet. Likewise, with the ring, can't use it, might as well not keep it. Oh man, that gave us a Pretty sizable jump up into the Alexa territory there. Alrighty, let's scroll on down to the Raptorial Leg. I'm sure we could sell a lot of the trophies too. I mean, I, I haven't done so. They do say raw materials, and it's possible that we need them for stuff, but we don't have a lot of junk laying around either. I feel like I don't need that many to mag torches, but I'm going to keep them. Same thing with lockpicks. I feel like those are an overabundance. I am going to sell two of my jackhammers because I feel like we don't need that many. Boy, do we have a lot of stuff. Oh, boy. Oh, this is some other junk. Okay, we can get rid of some of these things. The unusable first aid kits. The oil lamps, sure. Brooms. I mean, you are a traveling merchant. I'm merchanting with you, friend. That's a, that's a phrase, right? Merchanting? No? It's a tough thing to say. Merchanting. There we go. That's a little bit better. Oh, I just sold the casket. Did I want to do that? I think so, but... Uh, could be valuable. I'm going to keep it for now. Okay, and with that, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to accept my trade. So I now have more PP bullets. Not a tremendous amount. Didn't I have 44 and I bought 20? Did I buy 25? I don't know. It's fine. Alright. Ray, what are you doing here, buddy? Why are you here? Hey, man. Not a minute too early. The guys up there have already seen me. If we're unlucky... They will have reported me, and we'll have the bounty hunters after us. Uh, you mean uh. you will have bounty hunters after you? Ah, come on. Don't fool around. Those guys don't take prisoners. Oh, okay. What are you planning now? What are you planning now? There is a guy called Wyatt I need to find. That ass bag is the one distributing the contracts on me up there in the fort. That make him a diaper? I want to find out who paid him. I want you there with me in the background. I have a better idea. I speak with Wyatt, and you stay in the background. All right. Okay, that will work. Let's go. Now? Let's not fight. We have to do it quickly. I can feel a target on my back even now. If those guys recognize me, we may have trouble, so be careful. Um, you know I have no health, right? Like, I wasn't ready for... Oh, boy. 
Well, let's go tag this thing up. Come on. Yeah. Hey, buddy. Welcome, brave traveler. Though you have walked far and the journey has been hard, you have now arrived in paradise. Uh huh. That'll be 200 shards admission, please. I assume that payment covers both of us? It did. Now it doesn't. Uh. Then I suggest we find another way in. Wait, wait. Okay. 200 for both of you. All right? Uh, yeah. I've already paid you. Uh. Here. 200 shards. Uh, what? Huh? 200 shards to enter paradise. I... Have a day of dreams and remember the man who made it all possible. Me. Yeah, I didn't give you 200 shards, but whatever, this I guess. I need a bed before, before I go that way. I've heard a lot about it. I'm intrigued to see what we find inside. Ooh. Piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. Metal scrap, pick lock, gold nugget. Ah, uh, hey there, weapons trader man. Can I borrow some of all of your equipment? Your beer and your apple are mine. Just, you know, I'm embracing the, uh, the way. Not now. There is nothing for you here. Oh, gosh. Why are you trying to attack Don't me? Don't try whoa, 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 whoa. I just want to take a nap. Jeez, guys. Calm your beards. There's that tank over there. My goodness, there's a lot of random stuff. I'm gonna pick up the metal scrap over here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What's going on? A little bit of iron ore. Mm -hmm. Is there a free bed laying around? Because I could really use a nap. Hey, outlaw. Let's go. Oh, there is. Sweet. Please don't kill me. I'm sleeping till morning. It's been a long day. I got attacked by a troll and all sorts of other horrible things. I need this. Okay, now we can go get killed. Let's go get killed. But before we go get killed, let's steal the hammer on the roof. It's much like a fiddler on the roof, but with less terrible music, I guess you can call it. I mean, I wouldn't, but some people might. Come on. Come on. Get on. Let's go. That shit bag. <gasps> Wyatt is over there. Then I will talk to him. Okay, but be careful. But be careful. That's Wyatt? That's an outlaw. Uh, so that didn't look like an, uh, that didn't look like a Wyatt to me. All right, Wyatt, what you got, buddy? Yeah. What do you want? What do you know about a contract taken out on an outlaw called Ray? Who did you say? Ray, from Tavar. Ah, that guy. Are you here to collect or just get information on the reward? Yeah, both. Let's say I have an interest in making sure nothing happens to him. Just tell me what you know. Just tell me what you know. That is charming. And is there a part where you tell me what that has to do with me? They say you are distributing these contracts and that there's quite a high sum set out on his head. Hey, don't fool around. Mm, you don't look like you're joking around, huh? <laughs> is that bum even paying you anything to come here and make a fool of yourself? But good. I don't want any trouble with you. Say what you want and just get out, okay? What? Did that make any sense to anyone else? How many of these contracts do you have left? Who told you to distribute these? Maybe that's Who the Who told question. you to distribute these? <laughs> you mean I should tell you the name of a person who takes out contracts on someone who upsets them? Can you see why I might say no to that? <laughs> How many of these contracts do you have left? Just one more. Give it to me. You know, me giving you this is useless. The other contracts are already out there. You want me to hurt you, and then you give me the contract? All right, all right. Take it. For all the good it'll do you. Tell us who has the rest of these contracts. Oh, enough. They've been going faster than the offer of free beer. Uh, what would happen if I took care of Ray right now? Would I get the reward? Or, hmm, it's the middleman. So, you're not behind this hit. You're just a middleman. That's me. Mr. Transaction. Mr. Transaction. And I will get out of here if that's okay. So have a good one. You too. A contract. Not wanted alive. Wanted dead. 
<laughs> it's for an outlaw by the name of Ray. That was remarkable. Thank you. See, this is why I keep you around, buddy. It's definitely not for your fighting prowess. Or your, uh, well, conversational skills. It's for your random, just silly, added nothings. That's why I keep you around. Also, you make good, um, bait for things trying to eat me. Generally, they'll stop trying to eat me, start eating you, and then I don't end up being dead. Or at least I die a little later on down the road. All of these are considered good things in my opinion. I mean, I could be wrong, but I don't think I am. Okay, so now that we're pilfering and looting this place, this place sucks. I don't like it at all. Yet. We'll see if I like it more as we go. Sup, dude? Oh, man. You... If you're that ugly with a mask on, hmm. I'm not sure I want to see what you look like without it. Oh, this is free bolts. Oh, wait, I have a crossbow I, I haven't actually got to check out yet. I should do that. That sounds like a fun idea. Let's do that. My ranged weapons are starting to get a bit higher. Oh, it's, well, it's understandably weaker. Is it weaker than my hunting bow? 45 damage versus, yeah, it is significantly weaker. Well, maybe we don't use that right away. Why, what, what, what are you, hello? Hi. Sub Jackal. What's going on, buddy? Huh? Yeah? Why can't all of you be that docile? Why you guys gotta be so angry at me all the time? Trying to kill me and do murder to my face. What, what are you doing? Oh. Oh, oh. Ah! Oh, God. Oh, please don't kill me. I didn't mean to watch you eat. I'm sorry. Okay. Well, this place is very large and confusing. Oh, well, I suppose if we're going to do something, we should probably figure out what that something is that we're going to do. Contract on the outlaw. Yep. Gotta mark this bad boy on our map. Uh, where is Ray? That was a pretty interesting... <coughs> oh. Somehow I missed jumped. That was that was a special move that I did there. Surprise! Excuse me, miss. Ray, what are you doing, buddy? Are you still trying to tell me you don't know who it is that's trying to kill you? Are you still trying to tell me you don't know who is trying to kill you? What? Yeah. Honestly, I really don't know. Why would I go chasing Wyatt otherwise? The contract taken out on you says to contact W for payment. W? That could be Wyatt, but no. If Wyatt got the job to put this hit out there, then I know who gave him the contract. Wyatt and I were on the same crew at one time. We were part of Jackson's gang. They were bad times, and the earnings were slim. In the end, I left the group just before they all drifted away looking for better earnings. Wyatt must still be in contact with those guys. If you knew all of this before, then why did you drag me here? I didn't know for sure. Still don't. And coming here to find out might have got me killed over the wrong idea. Hmm. So, how do you think this will play out now? Listen, I know I owe you. And I know I will only survive this with solid company. So I am going to stick with you until my debt over the armor is paid off, okay? I'll help you. I'll fight alongside you. In return, you help me find Jackson's old boys and collect all the copies of this contract. You stole my armor and left me for dead. You already owe me. Yep. I know, I know. And I will pay you double what they're worth in return. As well as helping you. What do you say? Uh, I guess it's the best deal I will get from you. I guess it's the best deal I will get from you. Wow. That even sounds like optimism. And nope, that's no, it doesn't. an ice block. It seems my brother was right. You really are normal people behind your frozen facade. Okay then. Tell me where I should go, and I am there. I have a camp. Yeah, yeah, I already know where you stole your things. You were watching me? Hey, I sort of gathered you might be pissed at me. I, I thought knowing where you were might stop you doing something you'd regret. I know I'll regret this. Well, yeah. Wow, you've done the whole, you know. No, I don't. What are you talking about? Yeah, really, what are you talking well, about? Well, now that you're one of the clerics... 
Yes, I've joined a faction. Yeah, you've gone and signed your life away to them. That's like serious shit. Yeah, it is. Well, to some people. I mean, I'm supposed to be an outlaw, but you know. No, I don't know. <laughs> well, never taking it too seriously. Well, I have. I just haven't been that good at it. That's fair. Well, I have, just not dedicated. You know. No. From now on, Ray, just assume I don't know and don't ask. Okay. <laughs> you have a brother? You have a brother? Yeah, Tom. He's all that's left in my family. Is he as messed up as you? Mm. Oh, no. He's much worse. I'm always having to get him out of trouble. Right. Yeah. All right, contracts. Tell me about these contracts. Okay, the situation is this. I lost track of the guys from Jackson's gang. I think they were looking for another crew to join. They really needed to make a profit. Out of them all, Mason, Bombie, and Jackson will probably be the hardest to find. What I do know, though, is that Leo stayed in the desert. Tell me when you're ready, and we can go find him. I'm ready. Let's go find Leo. Yeah, I saw Mason. He's looking for you. I saw Mason. He's looking for you. Is that a fact? Well, I know his weakness. I can probably pay him off with a few shards. If we can find him. Whoa, that was a weird thing. I've met Bombay. I've met Bombay. He is a character, huh? I know he was looking for me in Abessa, but he could also be anywhere now. Huh. Alright, let's find Leo. Okay, let's find Leo. He's staying on the coast. I'll show you the way. Yay, Leo. Are we teleporting? Yeah, that's new. There it is. Leo's hideout. Only thing is, he's likely to act big if his friends are there. And that might mean they support him. You mean nobody in there is going to help us? Yeah. Yeah. They're the desperate outlaw type in there. The only thing they'll help us out with is... is damn. You know, I thought I had a good one-liner there. But it's gone. Hey, that was great. This is the... No, this isn't the... I'm like, is this the mine place? I feel like it's the mine place. Um, uh, what? Where? Did you eat Falk? What? Dude, don't eat my other people. Where's Falk? I did Boy. Where the heck are we? Huh. Well, this is going to go very poorly. I'm almost guaranteed. All right, let's go see if we can find some landmines. Step on them, blow ourselves to pieces. Sounds like a good plan, don't you think? Well, nobody's killed us yet. Oh! Oh, there's a whole bunch of you guys. Maybe I should probably not just try to go and... Uh, Ray, what are you doing, buddy? That did not work at all how I had planned. Ah! At least somebody can't shoot the defense. Look at that amazing jump guy. There it goes. Ha ha! Tee hee! I feel like I may regret that. Where are they going? Ah! Oh, it's like that, is it? What's up, Leo? Yeah. So. Hey, whatever. He was coming at me. There's no way he's dead. How weak was he? What? Ray, what are you? What? What is that weapon that you have? Oh my goodness! You may be the strongest person alive. What? I mean, that went south quick, but then it went back north again. Yeah, that's a. You've done it now. Oh, who said that? I feel like that was way closer. 
What? Are we fighting now? Come on, you bastard! Oh boy. Oh, I ended myself. No, I think I quick save beforehand. Where did he come from? So I'm not really. Maybe Leo was just like super weak, and the other guys were like really, really, really ridiculously strong. Or I didn't quick save like I thought I did, and this is all just terrible now. Yeah, yeah, I'm leaning toward that being what happened. Leo, where you at? Oh gosh, there's the Skex. That did not seem to want to eat me. Okay, well everything's set up the way it's supposed to be now, as far as my yeah, equipment goes. That's a ruin, all right. Hmm. Well, obviously the Reavers don't much care for my presence in their little area. Also, they're really, really, really ridiculously strong. So there's that. Not entirely certain as get away from me. where Leo is. Oh gosh! Oh gosh! <clears throat> How did that hit me? I was behind a wall. That would be a really excellent time to figure out how stuff works. Ah! Shenanigans! There's so many shenanigans coming after me! Well, he's dead. Hey! Take it easy, buddy. What the fuck? What'd you say, Ray? Ah, uh, you know, Ray. It's not bad. I mean, he hits pretty darn hard. Uh, Alright, we're going to do a quick save now. Oh, gosh. Oh, shitty McGee is coming. Oh, he hit me. I suppose I'll have to deal with this one. Yeah. It's you, buddy. dead. Well, Ray, you know, if you keep doing this, you may be replacing Falk. I mean, like I said, we don't keep him around for his, uh, his combat prowess, so if we have somebody with combat prowess, yeah, it might be okay. Alright, there should only be one left. The guy with the giant glowing axe, I think? Hello? Hello, Marco Polo? There's no way they're all dead. So where's... Oh, I thought the guy was flying in the sky. I'm like, so where's the last dude? Hello? Hello? Huh. Well, again, kudos to Ray for, like, manning up and getting some stuff handled. I really need some uh, increased equipment and just better stuff all around. Hopefully this will net me some decent experience, give me at least one more level, and then I think that'll put me within range of, like, a new weapon? At least, if nothing else, new melee weapon? Maybe? Not positive, but I think that's the case. Ooh, a strong elix drink. That's pretty good, if I recall correctly. Is that a dead guy? I feel like that's a dead guy. He did die in a very uncomfortable way, though. Not gonna lie. 
Well, we know there was four? Four guys? I'm pretty sure there was four. There was Leo and three... Maybe there's only two. Leo and two guys. I don't know. Either way, ladies and gentlemen, we're about out of time for this particular episode. I'm going to head on into this little dark area in here. And we're going to break off the episode after I kill some rats. Why? Because rodent murder is the best murder. Also, it's about my speed. Everything else, I kind of have to rely on uh, trickery and chicanery. So, you know, it's, it's good. It's good. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, till the very next episode, my name's Bumpy McSquiggums. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you next time with more Elix. Bye.